Start by setting a bodhicitta motivation. The purpose of my life is I engage in this meditation because Place your hands in whatever position is comfortable for you and close your eyes. Visualize a white ohm at the upper center of your head, a red ah at your throat, and a blue whom at your heart. These letters are made of radiant light. If you cannot visualize these letters in Tibetan or Sanskrit, you can visualize them in English or any other language, any symbol that represents these sounds. Concentrate on the white ohm in your head. Recognize that this white ohm is the pure energy of the divine body of the Buddhas and Bodhisattvas. Make the sound ohm and visualize that radiant white light emanates from the syllable, goes down your central psychic channel, and fills your whole body with blissful radiant white light energy. All conceptions and impure energy of body are cleansed and purified. Visualize that your entire body from head to toe becomes completely full of blissful radiant white light energy, Continue making the sound OM while meditating on purifying the body.
you stop making the sound, do not do or think anything. Remain perfectly still, fully aware, unconcerned with good or bad, not reacting, free of any internal conversation, with all your attention on the light consciousness at the center of your brain. Be there, be intensely aware, and let go, without sluggishness, without distraction, without expectation. Intensive awareness leads to the experience of zero, or egolessness, emptiness, nothing existing from its own side. Comprehend this intense awareness and let go. And now concentrate on the red awe at your throat chakra, like the sun at sunset. Recognize that this awe is the pure speech of the Buddhas and Bodhisattvas. Make the sound awe for two or three minutes and visualize that radiant red light emanates from the syllable, goes down your central psychic channel, and fills your whole body with blissful radiant red light energy. All impure conceptions and energies of speech are cleansed and purified. finish the recitation just be without any expectation or interpretation in a state of intense awareness of your own consciousness stay there without any expectation or interpretation of anything just be intensive awareness stay there
When you experience a non-dual, non-self-existent I or nothingness or zero or empty or space, comprehend this is truth, reality. It gives strength of the energy for the comprehension that everything is empty of inherent existence because it dependently arises. Creates the cause for you to rest in the middle way, free of extremes, without nihilism or eternalism. This expansive space is much more real than the waking fantasy sensory world. When uncontrolled distracting thoughts come during the meditation, realize that not only you, but also all other sentient beings are in the same situation of not being able to control the mind. On this basis, cultivate equilibrium and loving kindness for all others. Thus, your uncontrolled, distracted mind becomes a resource for the development of loving-kindness. When it arises, direct that intense awareness of loving-kindness toward your consciousness. Then, your loving-kindness manifests in your central channel at your heart as a full moon disk. On the moon disk stands a radiant blue whom. Recognize that this blue whom is the non-dual wisdom of all the Buddhas and Bodhisattvas. Your heart is pure, cool, and calm, opened by the radiant light of the moon and the whom. Infinite blue light radiates from the whom. All narrow thoughts disappear. All indecisive minds disappear. All obsessed minds disappear. The radiant blue light from the moon and the whom fills your whole body. Your whole body feels blissful. Filled with light, there is no room for fanatical, dualistic concepts. At the same time, make the sound whom. Feel infinite blue light, like your consciousness embraces the entire universal reality.
your intensive awareness embraces all of universal reality. Feel and be without expectation or superstition. Dedicate the merits of this practice to developing enlightened body, speech, and mind through purification of body, speech, and mind, developing merit through body, speech, and mind. May we actualize the fully awakened state in order to benefit all sentient beings. There are two essential experiences that we can achieve through this meditation, wisdom and method. The wisdom experience is intensive awareness of your own consciousness. The method experience comes when you get distracted and use that lack of control as a resource to regenerate loving kindness. Then when you are again free of distraction, remain in the experience of wisdom. In summary, when your concentration is good, Place your attention on wisdom. When you are distracted, generate loving kindness. Recitation of Oma Hum Mantra is very useful. Since you are often too busy to recite long mantras, you can recite this short one, which represents all other mantras. In particular, when you say Om, intensive awareness is energized and your consciousness awakens within you. The purpose of meditation is to awaken us from the deep sleep of ignorance to awaken us to universal reality, not our usual fanatic reality. Mantra touches the wider reality. That's why it is useful. This meditation was taught by Lama Yeshi in Switzerland in 1983 during a weekend seminar. The text was edited by Nick Rebush. The talks of the seminar are the basis for the book Life, Death, and After Death, one of the many free publications by Lama Yeshi Wisdom Archives. The book can be ordered or downloaded for free under www.lamayeshi.com. Used with permission from Lama Yeshi Wisdom Archive. May 2020. Recited by Lozon Yintin for non-commercial use. May all beings benefit.